What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. And finally, the moment has come. We are finally going to put my four star F14s on my M3. If you guys are new here, please consider subscribing and hit that bell notification so that you guys can stay up to date with all of the DIY projects and all the modifications on my cars. If you guys have not seen the last couple of videos, let me catch you up to speed here. Basically, I have a set of Forged Star F14s that I bought uh, not too long ago, and they were pretty curbed up. They were actually on a 335, and they were just in terrible condition. So got them for a super stupid deal and decided to refinish them and throw them on my M3. Um, so I've actually had F14s on my previous M3, so I already know what this is going to look like, and I didn't really want to go this route again, but the deal was so good that I just figured I might as well do it. So I took two of the wheels, I decided to buy two new rears, so basically I'm using two of the fronts that I, uh, that I purchased that were damaged basically, and uh, I actually have the other two that I'm going to have refinished and probably sell, but um, two of them are going to be 19 by 9 and a half. Uh, plus 24 in the front and then the other two are brand new Forge Stars. Those are 19 by 11 plus 25. So the tires that are going on this are Michelin Pilot Sport 4 S's. It's a 275 30 19 in the front and a 295 30 in the rear. So the Forge Star F14 wheels that I had on my previous M3 and my 335 which you can actually see here in the background uh, were gunmetal. So those were gloss gunmetal wheels. I actually refinished them at one point just to make them even darker gloss gunmetal. Um, didn't want to do the exact same thing and build the exact same car here with my current M3. So decided to step out of the box. I've always kind of wanted to do bronze wheels on Alpine White and that's what I decided to do. So this is our refinished set complements of JSC coatings in Cincinnati, actually in Milford. Um, we decided to go with a color called Mist Bronze and it's got an ultra high gloss clear coat on it and I think it's really going to pop on this car. So we're going to finally install those on today's video. I'm actually also going to throw one on the 335 just to kind of see what it looks like because um, if you guys have been following along, I actually have a set of 437M wheels that are from, uh, from an M4 and I bought these as winter wheels for the F30. I thought maybe it'd be cool to do bronze wheels on the F30 for the winter setup, but uh, so we're gonna get a better look and see what that looks like. I'm gonna toss probably a front on just to kind of give us an idea. So let's get onto it. Also, just as an FYI, I am removing the front and rear spacers. All right, so now that we've got the front wheel off the ZCP wheel, I am keeping those, so don't even bother messaging me about trying to buy them because I love these wheels so much and I like to keep stock wheels, so those are not going anywhere. Uh, before we put these on, I am going to put a little bit of NECs on the wheel hub over there and just wanted to let you guys know that I did two coats of ceramic coating on here. So we used some G-Technic C5, two coats, and then I followed it up with uh, one coat of Beadmaker just to kind of protect it. So we're going to throw one of these nine and a half on the front. Let's go. So I'm also opting to use some smaller open-ended lug nuts here. So all of these are actually from Motorsport Hardware. These are the long extended versions. Uh, this is a M12 by 1.5. Same with these. Uh, these are the long version, but I just don't like the way these look with the forged stars. Because if you actually take a look, this is basically what it would look like on the car, and I just don't like the way how that sticks out. So we're going to be swapping them out with these new Motorsport Hardware ones, and uh, should be nice and flush. Okay guys, one down. I cannot wait to get this out in sunlight. I don't know guys, I think I've got a wheel problem. What do you guys think? One, two, three, four sets of wheels in here. <sighs> All right, I know I still haven't shown you the M3, but here's a good idea of what bronze would look like on mineral gray. I can't even lower the car because the offsets are too low on here and I'm already hitting the brake caliper, so hopefully that gives you an idea. All right, guys, got the fronts on officially. 
running out of daylight, unfortunately, but... Ooh, buddy. Sick. Look at that fitment. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna have to touch the front in terms of height, but the rear might be a problem. We'll see. Yo, check it. Driver's side is done. Still have one more wheel to put on. The jeezel. All right, so I'm pretty sure I'm probably gonna rub here in the rear, cause look at that. And before I was tucking tire, and I'm very close. So, I don't know. Probably take it for a spin and instantly rub. So I might have to dial in some camber, but there's the front. Now looking at it, it makes me want to drop the front a little bit more. All right, ladies and gents, as you can see, I have run out of daylight, so professional pictures will be coming tomorrow, but figured I'd show you what we've got. I've got all four wheels on here finally, and fitment is, is gonna be tight. So I think I'm gonna have to probably dial in some camera in the rear. The front seems to be okay, but we'll really get an idea once, once we take it for a drive, but I am loving this. Look at that. All right, guys, the big reveal. There it is. How do you guys feel about it? I think it looks sick. Love it.